Listening 2.1 70% of British people read a newspaper every day. 25% smoke. 90% watch TV every night. 10% go to the cinema every weekend. Forty-five percent have a pet. Sixty percent live in a house with a garden. Listening two point two. Vase. V. Dog. D. Snake. S. Zebra. Z. Leg. L. Which. W. Listening two point three. S. She smokes a lot. She drinks coffee. He eats chips. Z. She lives in a flat. He has a cat. She does exercise. Is. He watches TV. It finishes in a minute. Listening two point four. Hi, are you Natasha? Yes, and you're Darren. Nice to meet you.、Yeah. Sorry, I'm late. No problem. Would you like a glass of wine? No, thanks. I don't drink alcohol. Mineral water for me. What's this? Sushi. It's fantastic. Don't you like it? No, I don't. Sorry. What food do you like? I usually eat at home. My mother's a very good cook. Do you live with your mother? Yes, I do. Oh, does your mother work? Yes, she does. Where does she work? She works in a supermarket. Listening two point five. You work with computers, Darren. Is that right? Yes, that's right. Do you like your job? Yes, I do. I love it. Computers are very interesting, don't you think? Um, not really. I don't like computers. Uh, what do you do in the evenings? I play computer games or I watch television. <laughs> Mm, what do you do at the weekend? I play computer games and watch television. Do you go to the cinema? No, I don't. I watch films on television or DVD. Do you watch TV? No, I don't have a television. What do you do at the weekend? I go to the cinema. Oh. Ah,、oh, coffee, great. Cigarette, Darren? No, thanks. I don't smoke. <coughs> uh, uh, Natasha, can I ask you a question? <coughs> yes. Okay. How old are you? Twenty-eight. 
Yes, that's right. And uh, how old are you in the photo? The photo on the internet. Nineteen, twenty. Look, Darren, it's two o'clock. Time to go back to work. Bye. Natasha, wait, wait,、uh, Natasha. Listening two point six. What's your name? How old are you? Do you work or study? Where do you live? Do you have a car? What languages do you speak? Do you smoke? What music do you like? What TV programs do you like? What food do you like? What newspaper do you read? What sports do you play? Listening two point seven. Keys. K. Girl. G. Tie. T. Shower. Sh. Television. J. Right. R. Tape script two point eight. Song. Something stupid. Stand in line until you think you have the time to spend an evening with me. And if we find some place to dance, I know that there's a chance you won't be leaving with me. And afterwards we drop into a quiet little place and have a drink or two. And then I go and spoil it all by saying something stupid like I love you. I can see it in your eyes. You still despise the same old lies you heard the night before. And though it's just a line to you, for me it's true. It never seemed so right before. Practice every day to find some clever lines to say to make the meaning come true. But then I think I'll wait until the evening gets late and I'm alone with you. The time is right, your perfume fills my head, the stars get red and oh, the night's so blue. And then I go and spoil it all by saying something stupid like I love you. Right, your perfume fills my head. The stars get red, and oh, the night's so blue. And then I go and spoil it all by saying something stupid like I love you. I love. Listening two point nine. 
One. He's an actor. Two. She's a politician. Three. They're nurses. Four. We are lawyers. Five. He's a teacher. Six. She's an actress. Seven. Are you a journalist? Eight. I'm a pilot. Nine. He's a builder. Listening two point ten. Parrot. P. Flower. F. Chess. Ch. Jazz. J. Yacht. Y. Singer. N. Listening two point eleven. And now on Radio Four, guess my job. Good evening, and welcome again to the jobs quiz. Guess my job. And our team tonight are Brian, a teacher. Hello. Liz, who's unemployed. Hi. And Marilyn, who's a writer. Good evening. And our first guest tonight is Phil. Okay, team. You have two minutes and ten questions to guess Phil's job, starting now. Let's have your first question. Hi, Phil. Do you work in an office? No, I don't. Um. Do you work in the evening? It depends. Yes, sometimes. Do you work with your hands? No, I don't. Not with my hands.、Mm. Do you wear a uniform? Ah,、uh, yes. Well, a kind of uniform. Do you drive? No, I don't. Not in my job. Do you write letters or emails? No, I don't. Do you work with other people? Yes, I do. Do you speak any languages? No, only English. Do you have special qualifications? No, I don't.、Mm. You have one more question.、Um, do you earn a lot of money? Yes, I do. Listening two point twelve. That's ten questions. So, Brian, Liz, and Marilyn. What's his job? Well,、yes. um, okay, Phil.、Um, we think you're an actor. Are you an actor, Phil? No, I'm not. I'm a professional footballer. Ah!、Oh. Oh. <laughs> Listening two point thirteen. One. He's Hugh Grant's brother. Two. She's Naomi Campbell's mother. Three. He's J.K. Rowling's husband. Four. She's Antonio Banderas's ex-wife. Five. He's Will Smith's father. Six. She's Kate Winslet's sister. Listening two point fourteen. Bag. B. Thumb. Th. Mother. Th. Monkey. M. Nose. N. House. H. Listening two point fifteen. 
This is my mother in our garden at home. Let's see. Is that your father? No, it's Martin, her partner. My mum's divorced. Does your mother work? Yes, she's a nurse, and Martin's a doctor at the same hospital. I don't like him very much. Oh, this is my sister Lisa, and her husband Philip, and their daughter Sophie. Oh, she's really sweet.、Mm -hmm. How old is she? She's three. Do you have any more nieces or nephews? No, just Sophie for the moment. <laughs> is that you? Oh, don't laugh. <laughs> yes, that's from last Christmas at my grandparents' house. Who's that? That's my cousin Adam. <laughs> Adam and I are really good friends. He's a singer in a band. They play in local pubs and clubs, and they've got. A really... Listening two point sixteen. Good evening, sir. Hello. I have a reservation. My name's Mark Ryder. Can you spell that, please? R Y D E R. For five nights. Yes, that's right. Can I have your passport, please? Just a moment. Here you are. Can you sign here, please? Do you want a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Here's your key. It's room four two five on the fourth floor. Thank you. Where's the lift? It's over there. Do you need help with your bags? No, it's okay. Thanks. Enjoy your stay, Mr. Ryder. Thank you. Listening two point seventeen. Good evening, sir. Hello. I have a reservation. My name's Mark Ryder. Can you spell that, please? R Y D E R. For five nights. Yes, that's right. Can I have your passport, please? Just a moment. Here you are. Can you sign here, please? Do you want a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Here's your key. It's room four two five on the fourth floor. Thank you. Where's the lift? It's over there. Do you need help with your bags? No, it's okay. Thanks. Enjoy your stay, Mr. Ryder. Thank you. Listening two point eighteen. Where are you from in the United States, Mark? The West Coast, San Francisco. Is it nice? Oh yeah, it's a great city. Are you from London? No, I'm from Cambridge. My family live there, but I live here in London. Sorry. Hello, darling. How are you? I'm fine. Yeah. Don't worry. Fine, fine. That's great. Bye, darling. I love you. Sorry. That's okay. Your wife? No, no, my daughter. She always phones me when I'm traveling. How old is she? She's nine. She lives with her mother in Los Angeles. We're divorced. Are you married? No, I'm not. How old are you? That's very personal. What do you think? Twenty-five, twenty-six. Thanks. I'm twenty-seven. How old are you? I'm thirty-four. Would you like another drink? No, thanks. I have to go now, Mark. Our first meeting's at ten. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, Allie. Good night. Good night. Listening two point nineteen. One. What does your brother do? Listen again. What does your brother do? Two. Do you like spaghetti? Listen again. Do you like spaghetti? Three. Where does she live? Listen again. Where does she live? Four. How old is your mother? Listen again. How old is your mother? 
Five. What do you do in the evening? Listen again. What do you do in the evening? Six. Who is he? Listen again. Who is he? Seven. Do you speak French? Listen again. Do you speak French? Eight. Are they Jane's books? Listen again. Are they Jane's books? Nine. Do they have a car? Listen again. Do they have a car? Ten. Where do you go to English classes? Listen again. Where do you go to English classes?